this is just another thank you video really um, this axe you see before you the money for this came entirely from all the videos I've been doing it's obviously a big thank you to everyone who watches my videos and I thought it'd obviously be better if I used the money I make off of my channel to um, get stuff for the channel rather than just spending it on random things so um, what I got was a Hanway Viking axe um, I did originally want the bearded axe but nowhere has them in stock at the moment so I just went for the traditional axe head so as you notice it's not actually quite a hatchet head because combat axes had quite small heads in reality unlike in you know films and games where they have huge battle axes the majority of axes had small heads light shafts so they could be swung very quickly that's a carbon steel head on there with a nice leather sort of sheath around the edge of the axe and it's a wooden pole some people complained about the poles online so that's why I went for the short pole version as it was cheaper and if I damage the pole I can always just replace it with a cheap sort of pickaxe handle or whatever so thank you once again and now I'll do a video testing it for you well here we have the axe itself nice light wooden handle it's got the lovely antique head on there and there's the actual blade there so we're going to test it and see what this thing can do now I've never used it before so I might cock this up but let's see if it can slice through um, a milk jug yeah <laughs> can pretty easily that wasn't a perfect angle for it but certainly has no problem doing that next we have a Ribena um, bottle these are a lot tougher normally in the milk ones so the swords often can't get through these we'll see what the axe can do against it made a gash in it but oh he's bleeding slightly but yeah problem is same problem with the swords these are too light but too thick to actually get cut up by an axe although we might be able to cheat a bit on this one I think uh, that seemed to work next a bit of wood absolutely no problem smashing it up now we'll see what it can do to a metal bin nothing really except put big dents in it also you wouldn't want to be wearing a helmet or whatever if that did that to it while you were um, wearing the helmet look at that, that went through that time yeah let's see what it does to the tree yeah it takes pretty big chunks off overall yeah I'd say this is a very nice little axe I'll try and learn how to use it properly probably get a lot better with this than the sword Obviously it's not like a finesse head on it, it's designed for crushing blows, but it can chop very well by the look of it. And a big thank you once again for creating this, just from the videos you watch. Cheers.